We are at, I always start these the same way. Okay. And you're always like, you always start these the same way. So we're on a little bit of a day trip. Yeah. Okay. She's got this. <laughs> it's Friday the 13th and we're at Shenandoah National Park. I hate this so much. I hate this. <laughs> it doesn't really matter that it's Friday the 13th. It just also happens to be Friday the 13th. But today we went on a day trip over to Shenandoah National Park, kind of a skinny national park that runs north-south encompasses the Blue Ridge Mountains and the biggest part of Shenandoah Park other than the hiking is um, the Skyline Drive. So this is actually a little bit unique because I mean we travel all over the country and very rarely do we get the opportunity to revisit a place that we have already been. When we were living in North Carolina at the end of 2014 in December we drove up here to visit my friend Stephen when he was living in Winchester. This doesn't even matter for this but like in the sense of reliving where we've been in the past, I like it because it gives me the opportunity to take better pictures than what I took back then. When we came here the first time, this was back when I was taking all of my pictures through my iPhone. It seemed like it was really long ago, and it sounds like it was really long ago, but at the same time, it seems like it just happened. I don't know. So we're actually doing fairly well schedule-wise today. We got up, we drove here during his first nap. We were headed to one of the ranger stations in the park. We're gonna get there around lunchtime. We're gonna eat lunch, feed him, and then after that, we're going to go on a short hike, and then we'll head home. So that is the tentative plan for today, and we're gonna take you along for the entire thing. All right, <laughs> enjoy Shenandoah National Park. Here we go. has her opinion of it. I am like 40% convinced that this trail that we're doing right now was the trail that we did six years ago. Trish says it wasn't. It's not. If you want to keep going, we can definitely see no. that it's not. I guess it might be not, but it's like, there's a lot of this trail. Maybe it's just the fact that we've been to Shenandoah before. There's a lot of this that seems very familiar. I think that might be what it comes down to. kind of wimpy no I definitely I feel like a wimp but we are not gonna finish this trail because he won't stay in the carrier and it's really hard to just carry him like this and the trail is really muddy so everything is very slippery and I just don't feel like super confident continuing because the trail just continues to go downhill and then we're gonna have to go back uphill at the end yes and it's definitely a little discouraging that everybody that's passing us on the way back up is puffing and puffing and covered in sweat. I'm just concerned about trying to carry this 25 pound child back up this hill. So we're gonna 
ditch and head back to the car. And I think we're gonna try and do an easier trail. This continues to be a struggle for us because we have not figured out a good way to carry him so that he doesn't get upset. The thing we cannot break him of is that he prefers to be carried rather than be in a carrier. So that's like the biggest obstacle we have to work around when going out and doing activities like this outdoors where we can't push them around in the stroller. But like Trish said, there are other options for trails. So once we get back up, we'll get back on the road and see how we're feeling and see which trail we want to do next. It is a good thing we didn't do that entire trail. How far do you think we got? Maybe halfway down? Like three quarters of it. Or okay, no, so, two thirds of it. So we did maybe like two thirds of it, I think is the consensus we've come to. Coming back, even though it's like a slight incline, carrying him, even alternating between Trish carrying him and me carrying him, it gets very, very tiring very quickly. We said we might do another trail on the way out of the park and then we looked at the time when we got back to the car and of course now it's 2:40, and it's time to put him down for a nap all we can do really right now is drive home and maybe do a couple of scenic outlooks on the way out of the park so now we are driving skyline drive north and you are either going to see the views of some scenic outlooks or you're going to see us driving back to our apartment one or the other depends on what we do here we go Great men running straight. 